Hello there. I just want to take a minute here to show everyone my uh, Sima X5C-1. Uh, this will work for the X5C, but I've got the Dash 1 model. Uh, the transmitter modification for the antenna, which I have right here. Took this off of an old Belkin router. Uh, just basically has a closable antenna with the wire coming out of it. Nothing fancy. I did modify this just a little bit. I took a paper clip and bent right here because whenever you do take this apart, this particular antenna doesn't quite fit inside there. Uh, I've seen some antennas that actually do fit in here. This one does not. So what I've got here, I've already taken the screws out. Done most of the hard work. Basically, I just wanted to show you what this is. Once you take this back off here, you do have the black and red lead wires going to the battery compartment. Some people like to solder on the back of this battery compartment, put their soldering iron on it, remove those wires. I'm not going to do that. I don't think it's really necessary for what I'm doing right now. Um, basically, here's your antenna. That's all that comes off the circuit board. This is just a dummy right here. This is what was sticking out the top of it. Serves absolutely no purpose except cosmetics. So what I did was I stripped back a little bit of the plastic insulation off of this wire here. And I'm just going to solder this directly to that. I'm not even going to go down to the circuit board because I just don't think it's necessary. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get this done. Some people uh, out there may have better soldering equipment than I have. This is pretty basic, but uh, it works for me. So, Okay, so apparently this is a pain in the ass. Um, I'm not going to do this that way, so I recommend that uh, you go ahead and take the circuit board off if you can. And in the meantime, I will... Uh, Keep rolling tape here. I'll get everything uh, edited out that I need to. And we'll just get this done the right way, I suppose. Since I am right handed, it would probably work better off if I just did it right handed. Okay, so you will want to take these uh, wires off of the battery compartment. Just hold your soldering iron on there for a moment and those will release. And go ahead and get these screws off the circuit board. Gonna loosen that up. There we go. I'm 
much easier the second time around here. Get a little extra solder on there. Just to make sure it works.